Hey guys, today we're going to be talking about the trench fire. Just keep watching. The key to doing a fire like this is you're going to want to dig a hole about a trench about a foot deep, and you're going to want it to be about eight inches wide. And if you got pots and things and you want to sit on it to cook on, you want to make sure that it's no bigger than the diameter of your pot or your frying pan, whatever you're going to be using. Got to watch out for roots and stuff. And the best way this works is just to get it lined up with the direction the wind's blowing. fire for starting in windy conditions whenever the wind's blowing really hard you can dig a pit just like this or a trench I should say and you don't have to worry about the fire going all over the place you start it right down there in that hole you can also do a version of this where you do it up against the log that works well too but this is a lot safer Okay hey guys, as you can see we got that trench dug. I went ahead and I put some rocks in it right here at the bottom. It was a little bit moist, so put some rocks in that to help start the fire. There's not a lot of wind blowing right now, but when there is wind blowing and you got this set up in the direction that it's blowing, that'll help fan the fire. And that's why it's deeper here and it kind of slopes up. So you want deep there, and you want some rocks. If it's if it's moist, it's, my ground's kind of moist right now, so that's kind of the best thing to do. And you can use anything that's dry, really. You can use dead pieces of wood and things like that if you want to, as long as it's dry. But you want it to get it pretty deep, good foot deep, and then you want it to slope up. That way the wind can blow into it and fan the fire for you. Okay guys, one of the neat things about this type of fire setup is that once you're done with the fire, you can just take that dirt that you, you dug out of the hole and snuff the fire out with it. You can completely cover the hole back up and nobody even knows that you've been there. It's kind of like a Dakota fire pit. But we'll do another video on that. But with the Dakota fire pit, you dig two holes. That's the trench fire, guys. Thanks for watching my video. Subscribe, and I'll have more next week. Thanks for watching, guys.